Hello everybody and welcome. Today I have the IBM M1015 RAID card. It originally works in RAID mode, meaning that it doesn't work in JBOD mode and it doesn't expose the disks directly to the operating system. But with the proper firmware, it will just expose all the disks to the OS and this is the recommended card after proper flashing to be used with true NAS or free NAS. It is very popular in the enthusiast market and I'm gonna use this to drive my new 8 bay silent NAS. So let's get to it. I got it from this company in the UK that sells used server hardware and they already flashed the card. So I have here the SAS address, address of the card, the date was flashed and BIOS version, UFI version and so on. It is properly packed and in the box we have the card. This looks like the original packaging and the low profile break, break it for to you servers. The card is very clean, looks in perfect condition. It does not come with the IBM options card that would connect here or I think here. We have two ports, I don't have the, the cables yet, I need to order them. It is according to the markings here a PCIe 2 times 8 slot. And with the two breakout cables, I will have eight SATA 3 ports, and that's exactly what I need for FreeNAS. For now, I still have the server running Linux, and that's ideal to test out if the card is working fine. Then I'm gonna order the cables, the hard drives, and start migrating the server. So my server, the first slot is physically a x16 slot, but only x8 wired. But it's very close to the CPU heatsink. And since you know that my server runs quite hot, since it's passively cool, I'm gonna use the second slot for the card. And that also makes the card just in between the two drive bays. Thankfully, unlike the network card, this one got into the slot quite easily. <laughs> 